Hey guys, this is Risk here, back with Mechanics Drills, episode number three, where today we focus on the mini map. So I linked in, not linked, but in the description below, I tell you how to get to this map. This is actually the hugest map in the arcade. It's actually never been played before. I'm the only one to ever play this map, only one to have found this map, and which is what's so great about um, this drill is it's a this map is absolutely perfect for it. So I'm actually gonna fast forward here. You're gonna spawn on this map with your hatchery in the bottom right and just start building stuff up and what we're gonna do I'm gonna jump forward two minutes in this little replay is you're gonna start sending units out singly you're gonna spread them all across the map now the purpose of this drill is going to be focusing purely on using your mini map um, so many players favor drag scrolling around the map and they rarely use the ma mini map and when they do they're horribly inaccurate with using it oftentimes overshooting or undershooting where they want to go where they click so this drill is gonna make you incredibly efficient once again I'm gonna speed up about a minute here as you can see here I'm gonna pause here I have now as you can see in my mini map spread out units all over this huge map and from here on we're just gonna be focusing on jumping from group to group so I think I believe I build a few more units and then we're gonna focus purely on the drill so it takes a minute or two to set up which might be slightly annoying but trust me it's totally worth it so now we're just focusing on going from group to group my eyes are completely on the bottom left I'm not even focused on stopping and looking at the main screen right now we're just focused on nice efficient clicks between groups we're not worried about um, really looking up at our main screen my eyes are purely focused on the bottom left corner trying to have as accurate clicks as possible between groups now, the nice thing about practicing this on such a huge map is that your target you're aiming for on this mini map is actually much smaller than it would be in a real game. So aim small, miss small. In this case, when you get back to the real map in a real 1v1 game, your target you're going to be aiming for is actually much larger. So you're actually practicing in a much harder scenario than you normally would in a normal game. So from here, we can continue on and see that I'm just jumping from group to group very effectively. And about halfway through, about 30 seconds from now, what you're going to start doing, any second now, pretty soon, I might have to jump forward a little bit, but instead of just keeping your eyes on the bottom left, what you're going to do is you're going to click on one of the groups on your minimap, and then you're actually going to box the unit. So first off, the first half of this drill, you're just getting used to jumping from spot to spot with your eyes purely on the bottom left, but then you're going to shift your focus to eventually darting your eyes back and forth between your main screen and your mini-map, which is a more realistic scenario than the other way around. But from now, just continue to jump from group to group. And as you can see, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna keep getting faster and faster, much quicker. And I, I cannot emphasize how much better this will make you. This is a drill that I've done quite a bit, and I would recommend for anyone of any level of any race. Obviously, I'm a Zerg player, but th this is a perfect drill for any race. Literally, does not matter. I just happen to be playing Zerg for this game. And I'm actually going to jump forward a tiny bit, because I should start boxing any second now. Where are we? Yeah, here we are. Now, you're going to jump and box. Jump and box. And this is a much more realistic um, scenario, but I would definitely suggest only um, boxing. As you can see here, I'm actually scrolling a little bit to represent how inefficient scrolling is compared to jumping. And now we go back to jumping. Jump, box, jump, box. So eyes, eyes dart to the bottom left, and then you're gonna, your eyes are going to dart back to the middle of the screen. So your eyes are going back and forth as fast as possible while maintaining that nice little accuracy on the minimap. And as you can see, this is much slower than the other way around, but this is definitely what it's going to look like. It's much more like this. And because it's such a huge map, like I said, your accuracy is going to be a little bit, it's going to be a lot harder to be accurate, but that's why it's great to practice this way. So you went, when you get into a real game, you'll be much better off. So I'm just going to leave this quiet now for the next minute or two as you guys can just go ahead and observe what this looks like. Just nice small clicks. Eyes darting back and forth. Maintain that focus. Precision over speed. Speed is not your main goal. Your goal is precision every time. Right centered on your target. Yep, beautiful.
Eyes to the bottom left, eyes back to the middle. Click, 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 eyes to the middle. I'm doing it so fast, but it's essentially look to the mini mini map, click, eyes back to the middle, box, eyes back to the bottom left, click. So it's that cycle. And you're going to be doing that as fast and accurate as possible. Anyways, guys, that is going to be mechanics drill number three. I will have where to get to this map in the description below. It does take a minute or two to set up. Like I said, you're just going to build up your units and then spread them all over the map. Doesn't really matter in particular where you put them as long as there's distance between them. So you have to move your mouse between the groups. Um, this is Risk, guys. Thank you for watching. If you liked what you saw, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, episode 4 will be on the way soon. This was episode 3 centered on map using your mini map. This is 1221 2015 and I'll see you guys next time.